So how could you access your iPad files from a computer? Let's get started. So if the files are on your iCloud drive, then it's going to be much simpler because you can always just check it out inside of your iPad files app. And in the left section, in the locations, you can just browse individual like folders. And if you open up the iCloud drive, you can browse the files which are there. And those which are on iCloud can be accessed easily on a computer because you can then just open up the iCloud.com on your Mac or Windows and just sign in with your Apple ID and you should be able to access the files right there. But outside of that, you can still connect your iPad to a computer using a USB-C cable and then just give it access to your computer. Just type in the passcode and open up the uh, Finder on Mac or iTunes on a Windows computer. And then you should be able to find and organize some documents right there, right? So you can just sync your music and, you know, sync stuff like that. So that might be very useful. But, you know, full files browsing is not really possible with this situation, right? I know that on a Windows computer, when you connect your iPad through a cable inside of your like um, devices, when you click on your iPad there, you should be able to browse photos and videos. So that would be pretty simple. On Mac, it's not that simple, but you can use AirDrop to just connect them. So, you know, there are all, all of these like ups and downs with it. So yeah, it doesn't really work exactly as if you were connecting an external hard drive. So just keep that in mind, but there are most definitely some options on how you can access iPad files from your computer. So that's how it works. Let me know below in the comments what you think about it. Subscribe for more guides and explanations like this one where we dive straight to the point and don't waste any time. Subscribe for more and I'll see you later.